Welcome to the channel. My name is Mattia and today I want to share my story and show you how working out changed my life and it can change yours. I noticed a lot of people in my community still don't work out and uh, since it has had so many beneficial effects in my life, I have to convince you to start working out. I have to show you what it has done in my life and how it changed it. So let's get into it. It all started, uh, actually, let's talk about before I started working out. I was uh, 15 years old. I weighed 58 kilograms or 128 pounds, roughly. And I hanged out with people with zero ambitions all day thought about and all I thought about at the time was partying, uh, drinking, sometimes even smoking, just going to party here and there. And that's that was my perfect weekend, partying, right? And it then changed very soon. But the thing is that at the time, I always tried to be the funny one. I always tried to make some jokes here and there because I was insecure about my body. I knew that if I ever was to get in a fight, I would get killed. <laughs> so the only way I could just survive was by being funny and uh, just hanging around because I couldn't even uh, try to do any comment or anything because if someone was to put in the middle my size or my body, I was gonna just get knocked out really fast. So at the same time, I never had discipline, never heard of it, never had a goal, never had to work out for something, never ever done anything. My life, like, now that I think about it, it was very useless. I woke up and I didn't have any goal in the morning or nothing, just chilling. My life was just nothing. And it all changed when COVID hit. See, when COVID hit, I stopped hanging around with those people because, of course, we were locked in our house. So having time to think and being on YouTube, I check, I just, I had just seen some um, body transformation videos like the one I did, it's in my channel, I'll link it up here. And those, that really motivated me to start doing something with my body. I wanted to change, I was tired of being skinny as skin. And so I decided it was time to improve, time to change. And I started very basically, uh, push-ups, sit-ups, planks. That's what I was what I was doing, and uh, many uh, different guys asked me, "How do I start? How do I start with the gym, bro? Get down and do some push-ups. If you have a bar, do some pull-ups. That's how you start. Then you implement all the rest by going to the gym. But that's another video. Uh, I started with push-ups, sit-ups, planks, just very simple. And I actually knew a friend, a good friend of mine, that was bigger than me, and I aspired to be like him at the time. So we started working out. I asked him if he wanted to, and we started working out in FaceTime every single day because we couldn't see each other. We were locked in our house. Our ear in Italy was pretty bad. So we was just um, hang, just having FaceTime and FaceTiming each other, working out together, doing push-ups, a turn each, and etc. And in the meanwhile, I started consuming endless, endless amount of content on YouTube, on nutrition training. I really got passionate about it. That's all I was thinking about, it, growing, uh, improving. And even though I was still a skinny ass kid, people were starting to see, like my family, for example, were like, why are you, you know, all of this stuff, you're looking into all this stuff and you still look like that. That's normal. That's just part of the process. Nobody will believe in you at the beginning, right? That's in everything you do. Then after the lockdown, so after COVID, uh, when we could get out of our house, we started meeting at the park behind my house right here and we started working out together and we created a new group of friends. So I stopped hanging around with those losers and I started hanging around with the people that wanted to actually improve their physiques, people that actually wanted to do something with their life that hadn't just parting in their head because that's what I needed at the time. And uh, so working out, and uh, getting bigger and more muscular, etc., became a true obsession for me. I, that's all I wanted to do. All I wanted to do, talk about was the gym. All I cared about was eating a lot and going at the park with my friends and 
not just hang out, but actually work out. And these, I gotta say, also prevent me having this lifestyle, prevent me from not smoking, not drinking. And that's something very rare. Very rare, no vaping, no nothing. Mainly here in Italy, everyone smokes cigarettes. I'm one of, me and my friends are the few ones that don't smoke and don't drink at all. And I think this is also a reason of that. And uh, at the same time, of course, getting bigger, my confidence increases. So I would go around with more confidence, head up, and I wasn't that scared kid anymore. And you can see in this picture, these are my friends. This is me at the time. Okay, this was probably more than, definitely more than two years ago, two and a half. Okay. And uh, then I moved to the US for a year, for my junior year of high school. And I found, luckily, a group of like minded individuals. You can see here in the picture where it's Friday night. We used to have, uh, we used to call it Friday night, uh, um, Friday nights, something like that, <laughs> where we would just go to the gym, a Friday night workout, okay? We would just go to the gym every Friday night while others were out, were out partying, drinking. We would just go to the gym, improve ourselves, and actually trying to hit PRs every Friday. And that really helped me a lot in my growth. Having like-minded individuals around you really, truly help you. And I'm living, living proof of that. In that single year, I gained 20 pounds of lean muscle. You can see there's no fat in There's basically no fat in here and i actually got bigger stronger and everything hit my 225 bench uh, 315 squats 400 almost 400 deadlift and it just spiked my learning curve and growth curve a lot to have like-minded individuals around so you can see in all this process how going to the gym changed the people i hang around with and changed the course of my life it's very simple and uh, now moving fast forward to today, I'm 18 years old. I'm 6'2", which means 185, 189 centimeters. I'm 83 kilograms, 183 pounds. And uh, I, separ I completely separated myself from low quality people. I don't lose time anymore hanging around. My mindset just switched a lot. And I believe the gym is a big factor of that because from a young age, 15 years old, I started separating myself from low quality individuals, people that wasn't sharing my same aspirations. And uh, I kept doing that and now I have even fewer friends, but they are like me and they help me in my process and I help them in their process. We help each other, we have the same mindset. And that's very important. At the same time, going to the gym built me my disciplined habits. This is, a bi this is the biggest probably thing about going to the gym. You need to be disciplined. To build a body like the one you see up here, you need discipline. You're not going to get there by skipping workouts. You're not going to get there by skipping a meal. You're not going to get there by not sleeping enough, by going partying. What you need to get there to have this physique is discipline. And once you have it and you use it to build your body, you can use it in your business. You can use it in learning. You can use it at school. It's going to serve you well for the rest of your entire life. So this is probably the biggest thing about the gym. It builds you the discipline habit from a young age that you can then use for everything else that you want to do. And at the same time, and this is also one of the reasons why I started this YouTube channel, and I inspired a lot of people. I helped a lot of people. A lot of people asked me for help in the gym, tips, and I always, always give them out. And I'm always glad to do it because people inspired me to start the gym. Now I'm in the position where I can inspire young guys 14 15 13 16 years old 17 to go to the gym change their life because i see the benef the benefits it had on me and i definitely suggest you to do it because i want you to get the same benefits and learn and just get just become the best version of yourself that's what the gym for me did and at the same time People, when I hang around, even though I don't like those people, even though they don't like me, people automatically respect me. And that's something I have to give credit to my physique. People respect me for my physique. They know the dedication it takes to build a physique. And even though they don't agree with anything you think, they don't agree with anything. When you enter the room and you have a certain type of physique, people admire you and respect you, even though they don't agree with you. And that's another big thing. 
And of course, now hanging around with this physique gives me more confidence. I know that I'm not 150 pounds and not 6'2". I'm not saying you don't want to mess with me. That's not what I'm saying. But what I'm saying is people think about it two times before wanting to get in, in a fight or something like that. And that really helps. I never got in a fight or anything, but still knowing that the, in a fight I have this kind of physique and I have a such number of such amount of power and the potential helps me in life in general because we know you could you can get in a fight every other day and for nothing you might just be in the street you a random dude try to rob a person next to you and you're there in the action and if you weigh 150 pounds and you can't run that's a problem okay so I'm definitely more confident, 100% confident with the person I am. Now, the only thing I need left is learning how to fight, and that's going to come soon. But I'm really proud of who I am, and when I hang around, and when I go around for my town or wherever, I'm just proud of who I became as a person. And last thing, let me tell you, don't listen to all of those that say girls don't like muscle. It's not like that. Girls like it. Girls like the physique I have. And uh, um, the people that try to tell you otherwise are just lazy and they just don't want to do the work and think, okay, I'll still get some girls with my physique. So why do I have to work for that? I mean, if girls are the reason why you're going to the gym, you're not going to stick to it. If you want to go to the gym to become the best, best, best version of yourself, then you're going to stick to it. And then girls are going to come too. So I hope today you see now going to the gym, but not in general, just working out in general changed my entire life. Now in the future, my life will be different because of the gym, because of the discipline I, I built, because of the mindset I built, because of the friends I now hang around with, all thanks to the gym. If I never started working on myself and doing those push-ups when I was 150 pounds, I would never be like I am today. I would never be here talking. I would still be there, probably smoking weed and drinking. So please, please, please do it for yourself, for your future self in three years. Believe me, three years just go by like this. Three years just go by like this and you can just have the physique. But please just start. Get on the ground. Do those 50 push-ups, five at a time, sets of five, and the day after, do it again. And then you see a, bu a pull-up bar, try, try doing your first pull-up. And believe me, it will change your life. It changed mine. It changed the one of thousands, millions of other people in the world. Start now or you'll regret it. See you in the next video.